Hello, let's continue this series. This is episode four, and we will work on these two integrals. For these two integrals, the standard method is integration by part. But by using Feynman's trick, we can calculate these two integrals without doing any integrations. By the way, there's a bonus part at the end of this video, so let's get started. We define these two integrals as cn and sn. To save the space, I ignore plus c for the entire video. First, let's solve c1. We know the result for this basic integral. Now we use Feynman's trick to take the derivative on both sides. Note here, this derivative is respect to b, so we treat x as a constant. After taking the derivative, the left-hand side goes here. Note for this purple-colored x is coming from the Chen rule. After taking the derivative, the right-hand side goes here. Again, this purple-colored x is coming from Chen Ru. So we are done for C1. Now let's look at S1. Here we use the result for this basic integral. Then we take the derivative on both sides. Left-hand side goes here. And the right-hand side goes here. Note for the purple-colored x, they are coming from Chen Ru. After multiplying minus 1 on both sides, we got the result for S1. I copy them here. Now let's solve for C2. Here I copy the result from S1. Then we take the derivative on both sides. So we are done for C2. Next, for S2. We use the result from C1. Then we take the derivative on both sides. After multiplying minus 1 on both sides, we are done for S2. I copy them here. Now let's summarize the pattern. To get C1, we take derivative on S0. To get C2, we take the derivative on S1. Similarly, to get S1, we take derivative on C0. To get S2, we take derivative on C1. Keep going, we can solve for Cn and Sn. So we got an alternating pattern for this method. Here is a bonus question. Can we solve them by using non-alternating method? For example, if we look at Cn, we want to solve it without using the result from those sine integrals. Similarly, for Sn, we want to solve it without using the result from those cosine integrals. By the way, we are not allowed to do integrations. You can try it, and I will give the solution in the next episode. And don't forget to subscribe my channel and give a like.